Okay, welcome to a scenario in combat mission Black Sea. I would argue this is the toughest of the combat mission options, mainly because it is very modern with good equipment on both sides. The one big difference is that in the modern versions of combat mission, if you get spotted, you will probably get killed very quickly thereafter. You don't get any warning time. You don't get any advance notice of anything that's coming. So in the World War II games, you're very often you can get a couple of shots will be fired at you uh, before anything hits. It gives you a bit of a chance to run away. Not so much, especially at these ranges where you know, anything over a kilometer is rare in this game. Uh, then basically modern stuff just doesn't miss much, especially the high velocity stuff if you're shooting in vehicles. So extremely unforgiving environment. Uh, the mission in this particular case is, uh, it's basically a platoon in attack. Uh, there is heavily attrited, they're being bombed overnight, mechanized forces. They're trying to do a withdrawal under pressure, set up defensive positions and the idea is that we're going to eject them from this area before they uh, they can dig in so I have to tap three objectives correction four objectives and then exit out the map so I've already done some preliminary um, preliminary programming so that you don't need to sit here and watch me do a lot of clicking the, the first 10 or 15 minutes of any combat mission game is usually a lot of clicking while you're giving orders or you're telling the troops in the back of the strikers, okay, grab your clue, which if you're, is the command launch unit for the javelin, which even if you don't think you'll need a javelin, the thermal imager on it is very handy. And in Afghanistan, we would use them as uh, observation systems, even without the missiles. And so we have to tap this checkpoint here, this checkpoint here, this checkpoint here, this objective and then go off the edge. Now the map, as you can see, is pretty open and empty. There's a river, not much going on there. Two main roads and the computer has decided to start me off with a split. Now I, I can stay with that or I can uh, move the vehicles from one to the other. I decided, decided I'll just stay with it. Uh, I'm planning on being fairly cautious anyway. So as you look around the train, there's a ridge line here. There's no ridge line here, uh, but this obviously gives good concealed movement up to about here, which point these guys will get out and start walking, uh, sneaking forward to see what's out there. Uh, I have a reinforced strike of platoon. So I have three squads of infantry. So that wasn't one, uh, one, two, three. I have a headquarters element, a platoon commander who also has a JTAC with him. Uh, and a sniper. I have two striker MGSs, which is the 105 millimeter gun, and I have a sapper unit. So some engineers with a 240 as well. Fire support, I start off with mortars and a raven. Uh, I've already instructed the raven to start looking around here. Uh, near the three checkpoints, it's got a, and right now it's got a radius about this big. And uh, helicopters will be coming in a little bit later. I will get some Apache gunship support. You may have also seen that I have a stinger. So the opposition might have some aircraft. I don't know. Or maybe they just gave it to me for the sake of making me think that the opposition have, have aircraft. So uh, I'll just hit go. Now, if you're not familiar with combat mission, this is... There's a couple of games of the type. Uh, uh, Gravity Tactics will be another one. But the general idea, this is about as close to a computer game, war game, board game, tabletop game with rules as you're going to get. It is turn-based. It goes in one minute turns. And you conduct your orders. And then you hit go and you see what happens. And it has, as a result, a very convenient play by email feature uh, that 
uh, allows you to play multiplayer by email. You don't have to both be at the same time. And I, I used to do this a lot. I've been playing combat missions since the days of CMBO back in the day. Uh, as for what's going on, so these guys that say coming up to the ridge and they're going to get out. Uh, I've set these blokes to come into this building and start looking down the road. Uh, in the meantime, I'm using the buildings as cover. Uh, if you have a look over here, you see that it goes up a hill and then comes down into a little building and you have a little bit of observation down this way, down this way. And it, it's quite simply, I'm not expecting these guys to do any fighting. Uh, it's just a case of, well, what can you see? Uh, so my first minute of movement is over. I'll just quickly check to make sure that that's the, that's the area that the Raven will be covered. Okay, so the Raven is now covering and it has already spotted a tank. And the tank in question is a... Looks like a 72B3 or something like that. But it's got a CITV, it looks like. So the fact that it's night isn't necessarily going to be sufficient to help me here. So the trick is to try to figure out where can he be seen from. And it seems the answer is from this building here course there's a long way between that building here and this building over here in the meantime uh, we'll see when the helicopters arrive if they can help us out with this little tank problem there's no hurry I have an hour or an hour and ten to clear this area well technically I don't even need to clear it I just need to touch the three checkpoints but in reality I'm probably going to clear it then hit the check uh, the objective and leave so I'm not short on time quite yet. The idea is to try to get about 80% of the personnel off. So, so far so good. Are these guys walking already? Yes, they are. I probably should have moved this guy up a little bit further. So I'll just do that right now. Oh. Or not, that was a mistake. Usually mistakes in this game, like accidentally clicking something, will result in some form of idiot walking out into the middle of op the open and getting shot. Yeah. And uh, although these are one minute phases, you don't have to go the full one minute. There is a fast forward button. And if nothing's happening, you can go ahead. Now when things actually do start happening, the ability to replay and listen because the sounds are location based as well if you have stereo speakers you can listen in uh, the premise black sea this was released sometime around 2015 i think it was uh ob obviously a long time before the current unpleasantness in ukraine however the scenario is basically assumed that russia has attempted to annex some of eastern ukraine completely coincidental except in this case the Americans actually get involved um, there I have one of the there may be some expansion packs in this one I can't recall the shock force is the other modern one uh, that was really more of a desert warfare so Syria Iraq uh, sort of thing uh, that has a lot more options it has Marines has French British what have you and of course the World War II ones have plenty as well uh, however I am distracting myself. All right, so these guys have made it to here. As I do a quick line of sight check, there doesn't seem to be anything obvious here. So what we will do then is I have a choice of coming up this well. The baby have the march up here and look at them that way. But what I shall do instead is simply march them up this way. So quickly hop over here and we'll simply you know, 
in fairness, these guys can't see anything, so it's probably relatively safe. So what we'll do is we'll actually put these guys back into the striker. And we'll take it from there. In the meantime, uh, let's see, this striker has only AT4s and the engineers Oh, demo charges. All right, so we cannot assume that the engineers have any anti-tank capability, but they can at least look around a little bit. So why don't we move them forward a little bit as well. And we'll start, uh, well, I guess we'll start an engineer team. Yeah, we'll start an engineer team moving up the houses as well. In the meantime, these guys are going to take a while to walk. It happens. All right, onwards. Oh, by the way, if you have a unit selected, then the only things that will appear are the things that that particular unit can see. If you have it deselected, then what you, uh, what you see is what everybody sees including, of course, that tank that the, uh, the spotter is spotting. I'm not quite sure where the templates are coming from, that there might be something else out here. All right, three minutes in. They're still walking. These guys are walking, these guys are still embarking. Let's bring him forward. Is he stuck? He's immobilized. Why is he immobilized? He must have sunk into the ground. Now the question is if he can unimmobilize himself at some point, I suspect, however, he cannot. All right, so in the meantime, stay on the ground then shall we and we'll get off the road at this point and stay there that's the MGS okay so he has night vision he's sitting there he can see yeah, you can see a few things all right so we'll deploy his machine gun you hustle Mr. Sniper into the trees whilst he continues to walk forward. Okay, oh hello, we've got more, more buddies over here. Uh, he's being spotted by the UAV, so whatever is doing the spotting, if you click on something, it lights up. So in addition to the tank, we've got a couple of PCs. Oh hello. Look at that, you got, these guys are really tooled up, so they got a remote weapon station, four missiles. Are oh, they the boomerang turret, is it? Yep, they're the same. Okay, so, hazards. You see there's a, a fighting position here as well, so they have a templated opposition there. They're still walking. And once they get here, we'll have them crawl to the building. And see what they can see. All right, onwards. Sniper, spotted by the machine gun. Now the question is, how is he spotted? So sometimes they'll be spotted by uh, simply re returning fire. So if you go back and you hit play, 
No, he was just genuinely spotted in a fighting position. Now there's an option here, you can get rid of the trees so you can see what's down underneath or you can just have the trunks. But yeah, there's somebody there. So maybe you can call in some mortars or something. Okay, we got a third PC being spotted by also the UAV. And let's see if he's the same sort. Oh, what a surprise he is. Now that said, he sounds like he's moving, so let's see what happens. Don't know. Uh, he just showed up at the very end of the turn. Okay, well, so be it, we know he's there. Oh, what, there'll be something here. Okay, they're still advancing. No, they've stopped. So they had been on a hunt command. And the other thing I've done is I give them a target arc, a very small target arc, so that they'll only return fire against something very close. I don't want them to re revealing their position quite yet. Oh no, they're still they're still going. I'm sorry, the the orders don't show up until after you go into orders mode. Okay, so these guys have climbed back in. Let us catch up with these guys over here. So let's see how close we can get. I also don't want to get in the line of sight of that tank. Which basically means this building. So let's see if we can drive around. Oh wait, where's that other one? He was there. Okay, so he's unlikely to be able to spot through that keyhole. You never know. But I think we'll be okay. So we'll get you guys up there. And then... I don't want to burden you with too many missiles, but it looks like you do have a target-rich environment. So what we'll also do is we'll tell you to grab another javelin. Just one. and go into that building there. Now, one of the other things, if you have you guys walk forever, uh, all the way across, not only does it take forever, but uh, they also get tired. So he's still spotting, you know, we'll give you, we'll give you a target arc as well. Again, Yes, and we'll have you hide. Just so that uh, we have enough time to call in some mortars on you. Actually, why don't we do that now? You have access to mortars, don't you? Yes. 10 minutes. However, I do believe we have a guy here who can call in some mortars. Except he can't see the target area. So we'll then bring in let's move forward anyway. So I'll have you come up here and then sneak to where these guys are. Give you a target, a small target, so you don't shoot anything by accident. Uh, 
and we'll have you hide when you get to the end. So if all these guys are here, it makes you wonder what's over here. So I'm, I'm going to be a little bit cautious about that. Uh, the other 1128 that I have down here. Now this, he can quite easily deal with any of the PCs that are there. He has eight rounds of heat available to him. Uh, but why take the risk? Uh, I mean, it's a 30 millimeter auto cannon. It's got missiles. Why take the risk? I mean, th th this thing is really designed for blowing up infantry strong points and I suspect there's going to be some of those as well. He is moving. Oh, hello. Okay, so we've now spotted yet another. They're tired because of all the crawling and hunting they've been doing. Okay, so... Wait, what have they spotted? They spotted a... Uh, and penetrated. So let me come forward here. Oh, the MGS. Well, that's bloody annoying. Yep, destroyed. And out they get. That's what I, that's what I mean about the being extremely uh, unforgiving. One, one little error and you're done for. Okay, artillery support is available. Right, well, let's uh, let's start doing a few problems here. So, we'll call in artillery. Oh, I got a scalibur. All right, let's do you first. One gun, precision, general, immediate. Okay, so it's going to take five minutes for the round to come in, but let's do that. He, at this point, does need to call in the mortars, even if it's going to take 10 minutes, which is a bit annoying. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll start an area target here anyway. Let's try that again. And that was really me not paying attention as well. That was very annoying. And we'll give you an armor arc. So what that means is, uh, oh, uh, two, medium, and we'll say personnel. And that's going to take a while to come in. Uh, but what we'll also do is we'll change you to an armor arc. So if you see any armor, go ahead and use your missile. And same with you, you're going to go here now. Let's go up to level two after that. And you also have an armor arc. It's a bit annoying. 
It's also a little annoyed that he shot through so many trees, and of course this guy with the CITV didn't notice it. It's hard to get good help these days, I guess. Which also means that the mortars aren't going to go... Well, he's calling in the artillery on this BMP over here, so... Okay, so five minutes in, they are winning quite well, actually. Oh, they've been spotted. So as I'm looking to see, of course, <laughs> the one guy he hits is my anti-tank gunner. This is not going well. Okay, get out of there, mate. Oh look, he's lost another one. The heavy gun. These guys are really good shots. Okay, so the striker has found somebody to shoot at. At least so it's not going entirely one way. Who fired that? There was a really long lobbing round that went a couple minutes ago. Okay, so there's not much for it. Pop smoke. No, not that way. Okay, so now he's facing that way. Let's see what happens if you pop smoke. Nope. Okay, so in that case, what we will do is I will do a face command, which I can't. Who knows, maybe there's wind and it'll pop smoke in the right direction. So I, I don't see what choice I have. I'll, let's pop smoke and then slowly leave. And they're going to be stupidly exhausted at the end of it. In the meantime, he has line of sight on this BMP, so maybe he can take care of it. He's moved about as far forward as he needs to. Let's drop this out. And we'll go forward a bit more. Okay, so let's deal with the problems on the right. I mean, it's a, it's a target-rich environment, as you can see. There's plenty of things for me to shoot at. And now I'm really annoyed I've lost the MGS. That was a grenade. That's my anti-tank guy. Anti-tank guy is still spotting. Come on, mate. Shoot the thing. Oh, somebody hit him with something. What was it? Somebody hit him with, I think it's one of these guys must have fired it. Let me back up and see what it was. Oh. So it's like a 40 millimeter grenade. It worked though. Let's go one for the underslung grenade launcher. He's taking a casualty. The Mark 19 is doing its job. <coughs> Excuse me. 
excuse me. Which means that he didn't have to use a missile. So, we'll clear your armor arc. And go back to a much smaller arc. Actually, no, I'll, what I'll actually do is I'll create an armor arc this way. All right, so let us now dash to the next house. Meantime, we oh, what we got here? We have another vehicle spotted by the UAV. Actually, we got two of them. Okay. And the possible here, so this is gonna take us a while. I'm also a little bit reluctant to bring this guy forward to deal with them until <laughs> I'm sure I'm not going to get shot through more trees. He's taking two casualties. Uh, okay. Oh, they're exhausted. Okay, all we can do is go in here and hope for the best. However, uh, I don't think I have much of a choice simply because... my guys are getting shot at so let's see if i can at least stay somewhat hold down there is a hold down command but I haven't really figured out how to use it correctly yet he's got another 300 rounds so they should be okay and let's move the engineers forward a little bit more And I guess we just wait for things to come in. Now, if it's 10, what was it, six minutes for the artillery? Receiving. Uh, six minutes per target. This is going to take me a while. So hopefully those helicopters show up sooner rather than later. Roger, fire mission request. Out. That was a secondary explosion. Ooh, an FO. Okay, there we go. Yeah. Come on, it's Martin 19. You should be murdering these things. Well, that's one. Okay, let's continue to move forward a little bit. Because he is still, somebody is still shooting at those poor guys inside the building here. They haven't even had time to render aid to their buddies. Although, in fairness, by the time the mortars come in, I don't think about it, I probably need to release the mortars. Because by the time the mortars come in, this guy is probably going to get rid of all them. However, we continue. They've made it over. We still have lots of targets there. We continue. Somebody shot him. So the question is who? There must be... There he is. What's he 
see armed with. Sometimes you have to actually get them and see. Oh, it's you're shooting grenade launchers. Roger, fire for effect. Oh, okay, he's decided to shoot back. That's probably fair. Okay, nothing for it. I guess we're gonna start shooting. Um, now one thing I don't want to do is I don't want to come up in line of sight of these two vehicles here either. So, first things first. I've lost uh, a saw gun already. I have, a, I have a second saw. So first things first, we shoot back. Then you shoot the sniper. You just stop hiding and see what you can see. You are deployed, aren't you? Yes, with 600 rounds. So that should at least stop some things happening here. Artillery's on its way. They finally decided to pop smoke. Hit upper front hall. Now what? Not sure what hit it, but he's reloading. So let's uh, let's back up a little bit. And then we'll do a little berm drill, we'll move forward again. Engineers are still there. These guys, well, let's move forward and up and we'll see what we see. And we continue. They've taken a third hit. Anti-tank gunner. Carrying a javelin is obviously not good for your health. I probably need to withdraw him actually. Okay, let's go back a little bit here and see what happened. Hit on the top hole with a 155. That probably did him in. Actually, he's burning, so yes. That's another casualty there. Okay, that seems to be it for that little spurt of activity. Aha, Ghost Rider. So that sounds like the Apaches. Yes. Okay. So we have two targets here and here. So we'll set up a, we'll try an area. Technically you could do a point as well, but we'll try an area and see what happens. Because it's small enough, I'm sure they'll figure it out. I mean, that's plenty small enough. We'll say heavy, we want you to use your missiles. Immediate, please, four minutes. Request. Okay, so that'll do him. Let's get rid of the tank. You are going to withdraw. So let's pop smoke. And then, well, wait a moment. And 
and move back. Okay. So things are heating up. How much ammo do you have? So you still have 200 rounds. You're going to run out of uh, 40 millimeter if you're not careful. Okay. In the meantime, let's move you forward to the next building. Uh, we'll give you an arc as well, just in case. And you also move forward to the next building. It's going to take us a while. Probably a second chopper here. The question is, do I have anybody who's authorized to talk to the hero? And the answer is apparently no, except for the CO. CO could bring somebody in. If I'm willing to wait the 10 minutes. Well, I don't see I have much, a lot of choice in this one either. So let's tell the helicopters to look here. Again, please use Stand your missiles. And let's see what happens. How much mortars are there, by the way? So it's four minutes. I've only got 40 rounds, you know? I could assume fire, that they're probably fire, not very fire. happy right now. And ah, oh good. He's pro he's providing first aid. Okay, that was the next thing he was gonna do. Which brings us back to the mortar that was here, and I've lost them. We'll come back to that. You gotta admit they are, uh, they're being persistent over here. If I were them, I'd run away at this point. It's amazing what just one vehicle can do. So there's somebody shooting at him. The question is from where? That way. Really? Could it be that building there? Um, what was that? The tank shot his own PC. Oh, he's trying to hit them. Uh, guys, hurry up, move before he reloads. This is where the, the minute by minute turn based thing can be a problem. So I was hoping to just cut across the uh, the fence, but apparently they don't want to do that. So I'm just waiting now for the next round to be fired. Nope, it didn't happen. Okay, let's change that to fast <laughs> in here, please. Okay, so he's done being the medic for that. Let's see if we can, uh, not quite sure where he is, but hopefully we can get a, the medic to work on that one as well. Now, if your medic effect uh, saves somebody, shall we say, it doesn't help you in the game. It only matters for your, for your score. He's not a dead person, but you can't medic him back into the, into the fight. I mean, once he's, once he's hit and knocked out, he's hit and knocked out. Okay, let's go on again. Well, it looks like they made it. Roger, in route to attack position. Aha. Let's see what we get out of that. All right. oh, okay, so we have 
the engineers of all things can see this guy but they don't have a javelin so they need to leave because eventually this guy with the thermals is going to spot the engineers all right this is a game of patience let's move you back out of the building I didn't take another casualty, did I? I did. Well, that was stupid of me. Okay, back into the building, lads. Trying to render aid, and look what happens. Probably should have left the mortars after all. Oh well. Oh, I'm not using the... Uh, Let's start that again. I really should have left them alone. Uh, I'm not using the artillery. So let's see if we can get another Excalibur round down on something. Request fire, over. Or we'll just plunk HE. Um, You know, with, with helicopters going on both of those, we'll leave it alone. He doesn't have sight. I'm going to have to move the UAV over. Actually, since the helicopters are going in anyway, they don't need to be guided anymore. Don't they? Well, tell you what, let, let's wait for the, the helo to finish its run just in case. Oh, yeah, what was that? That was a round of something. It's a minor hit, so it's probably theirs actually. So that was a minute when not very much happened. We continue to wait. Don't be in a hurry to die. They're spotting rounds. The question is, if they're the oppositions, what are they spotting on? Because that was way too fast to be on these engineers. Sorry, I just saw some smoke on this side. Oh, that was the pop smoke that the, uh, the infantry did. Okay. We continue to wait. If the air if the aircraft gets shot down now, it's going to be very annoying. Well, that's another minute of nothing happening. Where are they? Coming around. Delivery immediate. Okay. Give me immediate delivery, please. Ready to engage. Let's try that again. Okay, so that was a rear top hole penetration. I presume that was a hellfire, so I'm going to assume that didn't go well for the BMP. Roger. Cleared hot. And he's disappeared off the UAV screen as well. Good. Oh. Okay, so <laughs> now they are pinned. So that's, that answers the question of what Roger, that mortar was adjusting on to. Uh, I saw an explosion over there as well. 
and I see smoke. So I'm going to assume that was also a missile, which worked. Uh, backup hit top turret penetration. Well. Ready to engage. That should start making things a little bit safer for me. Roger, cleared hot. So what we'll do now is we'll move the UAV a little bit here. Adjust mission, area target. We'll try to keep them within line of sight, but we're going to move over a little bit. That's a bit too far, so let's come a little bit. Oops, excuse me. Let's try here. Okay, it's gonna take three minutes to fly from here to here. Okay, whatever. Uh, in the meantime, let's see if we can adjust that Apache as well because he's taken off the two targets. So, JTAC attacking. Oh, it's only a ceasefire option. Break, break, break. Oh, abort, annoying. abort, abort. Okay. We'll come back and see what the uh, spotter spots. So in the meantime, these guys have a choice. They're in a building, so they may be safe. Or they can make a break for the striker. Who probably needs to reverse as well, just in case. So I think we'll, we'll, we'll keep our bets in the building. Now the tank is gone. It's probably safer for them to move forward again. So let's go fast this time and move forward. In the meantime, we're going to wait for the helicopter to deal with those two. Roger, in route to attack position. Okay, so they're getting shot at by somebody. Roger, en route to attack position. Infantry, it looks like. Roger. They're in that building. Out. Yeah. Everybody's got grenade launchers. <laughs> and nobody's a good shot with them. Still have infantry there. Okay. Let's see where we sit with the helicopters on this side. Preparing. Two minutes. I can wait two minutes. The barrage was short and seems to have stopped. Shot. Over. Shot. Out. I'm waiting for the spotting man to land, I guess. Flash. Over. I didn't see the splash. No harm. Uh, that was that minute done. Okay, nothing's happening. We're still waiting for this to happen. No, that said, oh, I do want to kill these BMPs before I advance forward with anything else. Well, there's a splash. Yep, that was another quiet one. Now I've lost 20, 20 odd minutes already. And as you can see, I haven't actually advanced all that far. Shot out. It's a lot of spotting for that mortar. 
Fire for effect, over. Roger, cleared hot. Deconflicting airspace. So the motors are landing here, the artillery is landing here. Something I have discovered actually is that you can fire, let's say, 105 directly over the heads of friendly infantry and they won't mind. Which is not entirely accurate. Oh, hang on. So we've got an impact over here. Top of our penetration, there goes another BMP. It's Ready good to, to have attack helicopters. Roger, cleared high. Okay, so that should annoy them a bit. Two personnel, maybe. Still tired as well, so let's not be in a hurry. In the meantime, I'm assuming the healer is coming around again. Yep. All right, let's continue. Yep, top turret penetration. Okay, so that's the left side. Seems to be a bit better now. Roger, cleared hot. I have no idea what he was shooting at. So either he saw something or he thought he saw something. At attack position, ingressing to target. They can't be happy. Ready to engage. Okay. Now that that's done, let's see what we can do about advancing this guy. Oh, he's still immobilized. So we'll do two things here. First, we'll get our JTAC out of the vehicle. And get him into the building as well. He's now spotting where that sniper was, so you don't need to be up there anymore either. Let's get you into the building. Bring you forward and our other MGS. Well, you know, let's be a little cautious just in case. Let's see if we can bring this guy back up here. If nothing else, you can start rendering aid. We still haven't spotted these guys yet, though. Where's our JTAC? Let's bring in... Because we know they're there. We'll tell them to look around that area. Make sure they can find something. Heavy, immediate, confirm. He's got six Hellfires left as well, so that should be plenty. I think you can advance forward a little bit. Since the mortars have apparently stopped. And maybe now you can render first aid. The opposition are hopefully still pinned. Uh, not quite sure where they are. They're right in the cusp there. So the engineer was visible to whom? 
these guys over here. Okay, let's go. So it's an hour long game, but of course the actual thing takes much longer than an hour. Oh, I forgot to cease the, the other helo. Okay. Well, maybe he'll find something worth shooting at, I don't know. going on okay let's bring you up to the edge of the hill here let's see how the sniper likes the caliber 50 Similarly, let's see how you're doing. Sometimes it takes a while to deselect, I don't know why. Okay, and he continues to advance. I just want to get close enough to start doing yeah, I've got one dead, two wounded. In the meantime, let's see. Yep, you got one, two guys being medics as well, so they are, they, these two will eventually disappear and be out of play. Uh, attack position. Yeah, I've done it again. Roger, en route to attack position. What was that? Ready to engage. Ready to engage. I heard Roger. I heard a bang, but I don't know what it was. At attack position, ingress to target. Hopefully it wasn't important. Ready to engage. No, really not much going on right now. All right, so this time I am going to tell the Apache to stop stop attacking. Oh, he stopped on his own bat. Okay. UAV is not picking up the two BMPs that were there, though, which is surprising. He can or cannot see. No line of sight. So he's still a little, just that little bit too low, it looks like. Okay, I can see that. So I'm going to assume it's actually the same problem on this end as well. Yeah, he's too low. So I'll just continue to slowly nudge them forward. There's no massive hurry here. Actually, let's sneak these guys forward again and see what they find. So probably should be sneaking these guys forward as well. Oh, hang on. Somebody sees something over here. Infantry. Ha! <laughs> Gunner coax troop. Feel free to put a 105 in there if you like. I, I really don't mind. Oh, he's burning. Okay, target briefly. So let's see what happens now. Haha. <laughs> In the meantime, these guys medics. 
Yes, they are. So we're not in a hurry for that. They have cleared their medical issues. So let's bring you guys. Yeah. Oh, and they picked up the clue. They got the, uh, they got the anti-tank missile launcher again. So perhaps what we can do, depending on where these guys can see anything, we can have them sneak over that way and they're ready. So, okay, let's uh, put you back into the striker and we'll play with you on the next turn. Similarly, you guys, what shot at you last time? Oh, it's a tank. Well, that's now no longer an issue. So let's go one more, slowly, slowly, and continue. Yeah, that was a 105. Ah, now we've got something here. That's it, he's only got three rounds hash. Well, that's where it said target briefly. At attack position, ingress to target. Aha! That should be the attack helicopter coming to there. Roger, cleared hot. Okay, so they're in that building. Do they move again? Oh, nope, here he is. And he's spotted, yes, the UAV has finally spotted him. Hopefully the helicopter, okay, so he's in that corner. Hopefully the helicopter is aiming in the same place. Let's check, yes he is. Yeah. Unfortunately, we're now a half hour in. Uh, let us continue. Oh, I have another cat. Yet again, the anti-tank gunner. It's the same one. Where's the casualty? Okay. Let's move to him. Yeah, he's in the other, he's in the other square. So they, they didn't, because they were ordered to go to a specific square, they didn't move to the next square. Right, so I'm still waiting for that sniper to show up. So what's gonna happen is as this guy advances forward, eventually he's gonna see the sniper. He's still deployed. So let's get rid of these two guys over here. Let's see what happens. Well, they're still making it into the... Let's see, who sees him? Yeah, shoot at my buddies, will you? And UAV has picked up both of these two guys now. And the Apache has apparently picked up one of them. Ready to engage. Take that. Roger. Cleared hot. Now, unfortunately, that's just these guys. I haven't gotten, haven't even had a look at these guys over here yet. Oh, that was a mistake. I hit the wrong button. All right, no matter. Let's see if the helicopter gets another one. At attack position. What the hell is that? Oh. Ingress to target. At attack position. Ingress. So this thing are fired, but it must have missed. He's reloading. He's got another one round. Ready to engage. Roger. Clear. Can I have uh, an Apache shoot at the hind? Is that possible? No? Okay, so he's cleared. And... Right. Let us advance forward. I had a javelin in there still, damn it. <laughs> I wonder if that means I should, <laughs> I should strongly consider getting out of the vehicle. Okay, let's... Uh, Go really quick to here. 
and then you guys can get out. Before you get massacred. And I'm gonna clear the target because I don't think it matters anymore. Probably best they, they shoot. And in you go. Uh, all I can do is hope that this stinger reloads quickly enough and his one remaining round actually does damage. Because otherwise you're gonna have a problem. Somebody shot at them, but they missed. Is that my yeah, helicopter or their helicopter? The Are you reloaded? Yes. Roger. Yeah, that sounded like a fighter jet. That sounded like a fighter jet or an attack aircraft. I have a feeling something is about to explode, and I hope it's on my side, uh, on their side. Oh, the other one just got knocked out, and I missed it. So that means he was probably shooting at the sniper. Okay. Well, that's good then. Uh, right, in that case, let's move the UAV. And we'll move it over here to the police headquarters. start working that one out in the meantime let's cancel the helicopter break, I don't know break, if we have abort, any more targets abort, abort. Have. okay so I still have uh, oh they're, they're the crew what if they can get into the back of a vehicle yes they're not taking up too much space. Uh, right. Let us start moving forward again because I think anything that... Yeah, famous last words. I think anything that can kill a striker has been killed itself. I'm still a little bit miffed about that immobilized one. I'm not going to get my 80% off the map at this rate. Not with, uh, not with them. Uh, in the meantime, I think we can probably move the machine gun. Let's move them. We'll do a bound. We'll go to here, then we'll go to here. And then when we get there, we'll face that way and then deploy a weapon. In the meantime, their hunt seems to have stopped hunting. Oh, he's shooting at something. Oh, good lord, he's shooting way over there. Don't know why. All right, so what we will do for you then is we'll give you a move command. And we'll just move you forward a little bit here. wonder if... No, I can't tow. I don't think tow is an option, is it? Pop smoke, a minute. No, I, I, I can't tow. Well, that's unfortunate. I'm also half an hour through the game now. At attack position, ingressing to target. Roger, aborting. Okay, so who just fired a... Somebody just fired a javelin. At attack position, ingressing to target. Roger, aborting. At attack position, ingressing to target. 
Roger, aborting. And the stinger missed yet again. <laughs> and happily, he blew up an already deceased vehicle, just like I, for some reason. Apparently blew up an already deceased vehicle. I don't know anymore at this point. I saw, saw somebody run there. Let me back up. Yeah, it says it was knocked out, so whoever... Whoever shot it, it looks like it came from this way. Roger, aborting. At attack position, ingressing to target. Came from the right. Roger, aborting. I have no idea. Oh, Roger, that was the aborting. helicopter. I was. The, the noise of the launch of the stinger sounded like a javelin launch. Okay, so he's very definitely dead. Do we have another vehicle over here? Possibly. Okay, let's uh, send somebody that way. At this point, since the helicopter doesn't have much else to do. He was over here, I saw. So let's see what you find. I think. Actually, let me cancel that and verify. There he is. Okay, so whoever it was seemed to be on that road. I'm assuming what you're doing at this point is that you're either fast forwarding and seeing what happened and you did you know kind of rewind a little bit and find an exclamation as to why something happened. So I have a choice now. I can either continue to clear this or I can try going around. And I'm actually beginning to seriously wonder about the advantages or the merits of going around because I don't have to clear this. I just have to go through there. What was that? Possible tank. Oh, for the love of God. Oh, he's, he was already dead. Okay. I'll take uh, small mercies. Oh, hello. We have infantry here. A unit headquarters of some sort. Are you within line of sight? Let us see. No. I missed something. Why hit him? Should have paid more attention to that anyway. That's where I'm gonna go back to the YouTube and have a look, see what happened afterwards. At this point, I got not much choice. I gotta follow this guy and try to give fire support as he goes. Unless it was a helicopter again, was it? Must have been a helicopter. Okay, so I have one, two, I've got two, 
strikers left. And unfortunately, I think I have more people that can carry, that can fit in them. So I may not have a choice but to be blunt, direct, and just attack directly into them. So I still have the artillery that I haven't been calling in. It may be worth doing so at this point. Spotter busy. It's only four minutes. No line of sight. That's why it's only four minutes. I was hoping you could observe with the UAV, but apparently not. And it's seven minutes for him. Okay, so the mortars aren't going to be of much help here. Okay, engineers. Well, you you always did have a, a small life expectancy, so let's clear your targets so you can defend yourself. And let's go forward. Oh, you're the crew. Okay. Engineer squad semi deployed, so you guys can go here. And we'll get you out of the vehicle as well because the vehicle is going to go into harm's way. Of course, it's going to be a problem for to get out if everybody's walking. I'm not exactly going to be mission complete, you know, mission capable at the end of it. That was wrong. I wanted to go hunt. So, hunt is basically will advance until it sees something interesting and then. It will stop to engage it. Okay, onwards. Roger, get route to attack position. Oh crap, it is a tank. And of course, my striker is now heading right for it. And the Air Force has arrived and killed him off. Anybody got an AT4? No. 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 You do, okay. Um, yeah, this could be a problem. Okay, you got a javelin. You've got an AT4. Are you in a vehicle? No, no AT4 is available. Okay, so first things first, we'll try to relocate <laughs> the attack helicopter. Oh crap, it's ceasefire. Okay, let's see if you can bring in the attack helicopter. Nine minutes, That's, it's gonna be over by the time, it's gonna be over before we're done. Nothing forward, everybody with a rocket launcher, head that way.
hell was that? Oh. Hit the reactive armor and then it shot back, I guess, and killed the two of them. Just sitting there laughing. Uh, air controller, you're still one minute. So at least let's let's clear him at least, and we'll see where we go. But this is definitely not not going to be a successful mission on my part here. not going to be able to break through. We are probably going to at least destroy the majority of forces, but it's not going to be much of a breakthrough. Oh, for the love of... And there was somebody still in them. Oh, that was the, the crew. And there's another PC. Okay, well, we can bring in the captain's aircraft on that one. Stand by for cast request. Oh, the lieutenants, I'm sorry. Less than one minute. So we'll see what comes to him. In the meantime, all we can do now is just hunt forward and hope that they get the shot off first before the tank does, which is a little bit disturbing. Uh, target armor arc, we know he's over that way. Let's try it again. We know he's over that way. And we'll see what happens. Well, they're really going for it, isn't he? And he turned and went into full reverse, so he's going to be out of he's going to be out of sight before the guy with the missile launcher sees him. At attack position, ingressing to target. And I'm not seeing anything else there, which is great. annoying <laughs> I'm down to one operating vehicle with a caliber 50 drawing <sighs> still, have a, still have a guy with a javelin though so let's have you move over here and over here just in case he decides to come around this side, which is entirely possible. Well, there's the helicopter hitting him again. Probably should take the javelin out of the back, but at this point, getting into the vehicle is just asking for trouble.
Now what was that? Whatever it was missed, I think. Well, just while they ran away. You can see him, why isn't he shooting him? Let's advance. Because we do have to clear these guys out. attack on something ready to engage and something is burning Roger cleared hot so I'll take it as a positive whatever it was Acquisition. to target still waiting for the tank It's my UAV. So he's just out of UAV range, but it seems to be the only thing there. So let's move the UAV over again. And we'll see what comes of it. you forward and maybe if you go up in the hillside here perhaps you can get me a view or something you are a sniper after all actually whatever happened to the headquarters unit that was there now I'll mention it better go up as well give them a bit of support and deploy seeing anything we're shooting at so let's clear your target and we'll advance at attack position ingressing to target There's still that sniper there apparently Ready to engage. Not sure what we can do about it. Roger. Cleared hot. Oh, take... Yeah, of course. Machine gunner gets it. At attack position. There he is. Pressing the target. That my one of his. Ready to engage. Roger. Cleared hot. No, oh, they're shaking and hiding. At attack position, ingress to target. That's another fighter. Ready to engage. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Roger, cleared hot. Well, you can see him, so... Can, let's see, can you shoot this guy with a javelin? Uh, so... So he's got that one. So the JTAC... We need to, we need to move him. We need to move him only over there, it seems. There's a guy in the building. Come on, Gunner. Anti-tank aiming. 
Will we actually get a good javelin shot off now? What did he fire? I'm looking. That was a HEDP? He fired a HEDP. The help oh, reload. Come on, anti tank. There we go. Finally, a javelin actually killed something. Unfortunately, that oh, he's got a spare javelin. He's not done yet. Somehow, this striker is still alive. As is that. BMP. Let's move forward. Maybe we can get a better shot on this machine gun. I mean, I think by now he'd be encouraged to go elsewhere. Okay, let's go be medic. Okay, so all we have to do now is worry about this guy. Or that guy, I forgot about him. Let's move you forward and then let's deploy your weapon because it's more accurate when you were deployed. And no, you're still a met, you're still a casualty. Okay. See where this helicopter is. Okay, we get one more helicopter attack here. He's got to be around there somewhere. Stand by for cast request. We'll find that in about four minutes. The reports are wild. Okay, so somebody just shot him. Oh. Well, he's already dead. He's taking two hits. Why aren't you shooting? You come on, you're supposed to be in Overwatch. Can you shoot? No, no line of sight. Of course not. That's annoying. Why is there no line of sight? It's on the other side. It's on the other side of a uh, ridge, I guess. Okay, run forward and then suppress because you need help. RPG. Okay. You shoot him. You assault the same general area. And 
and you're not stuck so let's uh where's my helicopter over here two minutes well the tank is back sniper You're kidding me. Okay, I just heard something blow up. Oh. Yeah, lovely. Well placed artillery, just what you need. That's it, I, I can't do it. I just can't do it. Let's see if we can kill the, the tank or two, just for the sake of getting the points, but I can't, I just can't finish this mission. Again, watching out for him. See if you can get line of sight on him. So is my helicopter. Less than one minute. Somebody's about to shoot. Oh, you, for the love of God, there, there's another one. How was I supposed to in, in any way finish this battle? Roger, cleared hot. Yeah, he's broken. So he's not gonna be shooting anybody anytime soon. He still has his clue. I heard a boom, but I don't know what it was. Is that his we his yep, his right is gone. <laughs> so he's walking. Roger, Roger, cleared hot. Something happened over here. I think it was a miss. At attack position, ingressing to target. Oh no, rear tour penetration. That probably wasn't good for him. Gone. Where's the other halo? You should be looking around. He's rattled. Okay. It's engineer versus RPG, and the RPG is winning, very definitely. My sniper is gone. Roger, cleared hot. At attack position, ingressing to target. What that was. Ready to engage. Roger, cleared hot. Yeah, he must be out of hellfires. Mm. 
Meantime, red air is continuing to be annoying. At attack position, ingressing to target. Ready to engage. Ingressing from target. All ordnance released. Oh, yeah, Roger, lovely. Thanks. Time. Can you kill the tank? At attack position, ingressing to target. You got the PC. Okay, well, I'll take the PC, but please kill the tank. He's about to receive some indirect, I think. guy with the RPG is still there I think he should be being assaulted through and is it possible we won on that side amazing ready to engage something's firing Roger. way off Cleared the side oh these guys oh Roger. Yeah, lovely. more infantry position ingress to target he's just not wanting to shoot anything is he This Apache is. He's still got two. Two Hellfires. Will you please engage? Stand by for cash request. Maybe you do one there, one there, but I don't think it matters. Oh, they're broken. They're broken. I've got nothing left. Rattled. Roger. Cleared hot. At back position. In red to target. Ready to engage. Roger. Cleared high. And the striker is retreating. He must have seen something he didn't like. No, not that one. You've already shot him. Is he broken? Shaken. I can't give him orders either. Let's go, the RPG is still there. At attack position, ingressing to target. Ready to engage. Roger, cleared hot. I hear me lots of cleared hots, but I'm not seeing much things blowing up. Put some music on next time. Oh, for the love of. Yeah, he's been destroyed. 
Wait, something hit him. The Apache got the last tank. Ready to engage. Roger, cleared hot. Alright, this is just a battle of helicopters. I mean, that's all this game was. Is there a ceasefire option? Computer will automatically accept. Yeah, I'm. I mean, I could. I've got nothing else to lose. I guess I can always try to move the Apache onto the last PC here. What's he got? He's got one hellfire. Break! 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 Abort! 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 So it'll take a minute for that to end. He's where? He's just behind that wall. Let's go back to the wall. Right here. Stand by for cash request. Okay. And that's basically it. All we can do is just sit here now and get artillery. At least he's only shooting where I used to be. Now the question is, was there a point at which I should have stopped advancing earlier? Because my mission was to stop them from making a solid defensive position. And I obviously failed in that because I was there too late. They, they showed up. On the other hand, at no time did it look like they were massively overwhelming me either. Losing the MGS, okay, that was a bit silly. But it's, I, I don't think I could have accounted for the helicopters. Once the helicopters showed up, that was the end of it. I mean, yeah, it works both ways. Once my helos showed up, that was the end of it for them. flashing just says observing what if that means he's about to go home well it might have been one minute but nothing happened target going ready to engage oh yeah really well you got one minute to do it mate at attack position ingress to target hit for top hole penetration and that's the end of it it's mutual destruction <laughs> I think it's probably the best way of putting this call it a ceasefire. Major defeat, no kidding. Russian army losses were acceptable. They have 56 men okay. 27, they've killed as many of us as I killed of them, which is a bit disturbing. They lost two tanks, 11 armored vehicles. We lost six armored vehicles and one and the, the Jeep. Several can see. There is a wounded RPG guy is one down. He's quite healthy. Crewman, he's very healthy. 
slightly wounded, two snipers. Both damaged. There's a crewman. Well, they didn't do too well. I'm looking for bodies. Don't see any. I had another tank. By the way, what was he? He was a T-72 B-3. Oh, a missile launcher. Why not? Perfectly healthy. All perfectly healthy. I, d I couldn't do it. It just couldn't be done. What's that? A TRP? Okay, well, that was combat mission and a very, very tough scenario. Small. Some of these scenarios can be huge. It can be like battalion-sized scenarios. They take forever. Multiple days. I'm not going to ever run one of those on, this, on these videos. Okay, well... That was death by aircraft, unfortunately. Yeah, I've chat with a scenario designer. If you're curious, that scenario was entitled Objective Delta. So you know what yeah, you know which one to avoid. Okay, well that's that. Take care.